This is the Pelican Super Game M1005 Stresemann. Good luck with my horrible pronunciation. I'm slowly rotating the barrel so you can see that there are clear strips in it in between the anthracite gray. Pretty cool, like it's not a completely solid barrel, so in that regard, it's kind of appealing to me. Um, I think it's very cool, suave, elegant. I'm not sure it's my favorite finish. Like I prefer brighter colors and stuff like that, obviously, because you know me, but it is very nice. And if I didn't already have uh, M1000, an M1000, like I would consider this one. It would be an option. Um, it's a pretty big pen. There you go. And uh, I just thought it would be fun to do a bit of writing with it. So we're gonna do that now. Fairly wet writer. The ink is Pelican Edelstein Amethyst, one of the best purple inks ever, and of course it was a special edition. Thank you, Pelican. So yeah, believe it or not, this is a fine nib. Um, the interesting thing is a lot of people contact me saying that they're interested in the M1000 because they heard it has a flex nib. It is not a flex nib. Okay, just so you know. It is a soft nib. So if you see if I, I'm applying pressure, the nib is responding. Like it's soft in that regard, but it is not meant to flex. You can squeeze a tiny bit of variation out, but I would not do anything to the point that you're spreading the tines. Um, like this is beyond what is necessary. So what you're gonna get with this is a softer writing experience instead of something that feels like a nail. Okay, so it's gonna yield a little while you write, but if you are looking for a flex nib, this is sure not it. Not Flexy. Now it can produce some pretty expressive writing and maybe that's why people think it's like a flex, but it is not a flex nib. Just again, you're going to have a yielding it writing like it's going to yield to the pressure of your hand. But ideally this nib, this particular nib is perfectly tuned. So I don't need to apply any pressure. It starts up right away. This is free weight. This is just the pen writing with the weight of its own body. Um, this is ideal. And this is a really well-tuned nib. Now the thing is, every single fountain pen nib should write as, as well as that, right? Like it should be perfectly tuned. Um, so I'm really happy that this one is really well done. Um, but ultimately, this is a nib that you do not need to apply pressure to to get this to write. It just goes. Okay, so let's change the angle, take a look. 